What is important now is for us to realize that if we talk about reproductive health, implementation, there's no room for complacency. There's no, we, we have to be always on the guard because what we're doing in terms of public health and delivery of services is actually geared towards a better quality of life for women, children, and Filipino families as well. And is there any wiggle room at the regional level? You know, the DOH regional offices have their own budgets and there's actually maybe an opportunity for them to use those budgets for local programs at the community level. Is that also something we're looking at? We are also looking into that, but we have to make sure that the other programs will not be affected because the regional offices also caters to um, the implementation of uh, immunization programs, um, the implementation of curative health measures, database, monitoring, surveillance. These are the things that we, we have to look into. And lastly, you know, we have a looming epidemic of HIV. You know, it's exponential rises in new cases of infections. How has this budget cut affected, you know, uh, our programs for HIV? Well, um, we are making sure that the allocation for HIV will not be touched. That's why in the 490 million identified, 50 million of that goes to procurement of condoms. That's the first thing that we have in our agenda. And the others will be in the procurement of postpartum IUD, a few on the pills for breastfeeding mothers. And we are moving forward, looking at possible savings that we can also incorporate in terms of implementing HIV. What is important now is that people are continuously changing their behavior, knowing their status, knowing their status is something that um, is already acceptable in majority of the Filipinos. But of course, we still need to be more proactive. The stigma does not have a place in our society. Discrimination does not have a place in our society. We have to support our HIV patients. They have the right to be respected, and we owe it to them to work with them so that they are with us in looking for a cure for HIV.